Hi, I'm Tianjin, and this year for Utter 2017, I'll be doing the short story Time Pieces by Gregory Nelpon. Uh, Time Pieces is essentially a character study. It's actually several character studies, out of which I chose one um, about Margaret, uh, who is a kindergarten teacher. Margaret uh, goes through a series of events which seem unrelated, but uh, I guess ultimately uh, feed into sort of the randomness of living and life. I think it's sort of about how people and lives sort of collide, they kind of come together, they fall apart, and then we sort of just carry on living. Okay, then when can you come back? No, it's not. She's not getting any better, Ma. I need you to come back. Adaptation is not so much a translation as it is a transformation of a work from you know one medium to another. Uh, I felt what was needed uh, in the transformation to uh, the medium of short film uh, was a stronger narrative. That was what I strove to bring to the short film. Um, I asked myself, I mean, if if I were working with Gregory Nelpon today on the on, on the adaptation. Uh, how how might we want to uh, to take this character of Margaret and the people that she meets? And so the short film is sort of a result of that thought process of trying to bring the work from a two-page uh, short story to a 15 to 20 minute short film. Ealing, do you know that you're not supposed to bring dogs to school in the first place? Do you understand what I'm saying to you? Well, I think the old adage is that, you know, you should never work with kids and animals. Uh, we, in this short story and the adaptation, we have both a kid and an animal. But I think to their credit, both performers have turned out incredibly well. Um, but I think the main challenge is not so much a technical one or a physical one, it's more a spiritual one. For me, I think the challenge is more how do you stay true to the author's voice? How do you consistently keep that voice uh, within the work that you've produced? So um, I guess for the three days, I mean, the, the, the challenge for me is, is this fidelity, I think, staying true to the author's voice. I haven't done a short film in years, but, you know, having gone through the process of doing this adaptation has made me think a lot more and focus a lot more on, you know, story and what is story and you know how you can actually take you know a, a two-page character study and transform it into what I hope will be a powerful narrative. Mm -hmm.